what would you do in a situation where if you were stuck financially waiting for the money, you've got zero dollars, what, what would you do from there? Got it. So my first answer is one, use all the time you have to just continuously message, call up, ring, Shopify payments, Stripe and PayPal. Ask them, hey, you know, last time you said this will be released in a week's time, nothing has happened, or hey, I just want to call to make sure that this will be released in, you know, the 22nd of June, um, which is one month from now. Can you confirm that? Because I've got a one month estimate, but I want to correct time and I want to know what can I do to accelerate this process because I really need these funds and do that with all three payment gateways every second day, every third day, every day, every week to make sure things are going to happen and provide them extra double and be like, hey, is there anything I could provide on top? Can I give you guys my sort of emails? Can I give you the tracking numbers for all these customers? How can I show you that I'm legitimate and have all these sort of um, ways to be like, basically say, how can I work with you so I could get my money back? Yeah. And I'll do that every single day for those three different payment gateways. So that's number one. Okay. Number two, this is a perfect time to go ahead and fill up some gaps. So right now in your business, there's probably a bunch of holes, there's a bunch of systems that aren't optimized. Like maybe you don't have a routine for customer service, you don't have a routine for order fulfillment, um, you want to go ahead and transition from overload to DSs. Um, there's a bunch of things that you could do to optimize your business. That's what you should go ahead and do now. Yep. Three, you want to be spending this time learning, um, reading books, learning about how to go ahead and hire VAs, how to build a team. For the, all those next level stuff, you want to be focused on learning so that when things go back to normal, you can go ahead and implement everything you learned straight away. Yep. So that is number three. So those three things should literally take, you know, take, up, like, take up your time for the next month for money to flow back in. So yep. that's what I'll do is I was in your situation. Yep. Also, number four, organic strategies. You know, you could send out emails, your current email list. You could um, do posts on your Facebook page, Instagram. You could try Facebook groups. Um, a lot of organic and free strategies, that's another option as well. So that's option four. So that's four different things you could do during this one month break in massive yep. exclamation marks because you'll yep. still be working on these four things. 